getting low, so it's got to go quick. This is the last one. The other one wasn't the final one. This is the last one. And just to let you know, this is a 1 16th inch hex. And I've already loosened it up, so I cheated. It's cheat I'm cheating. And I also measured the gap here. <clears throat> I believe this is a quarter inch. Quarter inch socket or wrench, I believe. Don't quote me on it. Anyways, you loosen this up and then you just pull this off. Take the tool out, of course. And then just pull this off. And the little centerpiece comes out. It's just friction held. Then you take this tool and use it to carefully gotta size it. They move. That's why I hate using them. Size the nut. Loosen it. Pot nut. We call them pot nuts. Wonder why? They smoke pot. <laughs> anyway. Take the pot nut and the washer off. Pot nut washer. Knob. Inner knob. Held on by friction. And then this, <clears throat> the pot, the actual pot itself. I didn't, never see any pot like this. Let me get this out of here. This thing keeps on sticking and it's bending my gizmo. It's starting to tick me off. Why is it doing it? I don't know. You see how it's catching down in here on stuff? It's really mucking me up. So. This is uh, jamming now in here and keeping things mucked up too. So this is what you're up against. You break wires. You got things Jimmy jamming you up. You got the wind fighting you. You know, you can shit. Okay. Let's just take a hammer to this. Oh, yeah! And then just pull this out. This whole board comes out, and then I can deal with it better, you know, like this. And then what I'll do is I'll fix that connector and resolder it. All right, so that's it. Taking a hammer to the situation, getting heavy-handed. Trap red with the 20, Tektronix 20, 221, 60 megahertz digital source oscilloscope came broken.